Good morning. This is Dr. Bay Voda, and this is part two of my little sweet patient S's ear. This is her prosthetic ear that will go on her defect, her little microtia ear. And if you see the way it fits, it goes in here, comes up on top, and will fit nice and snugly on her ear, showing her earring. Turn this way, sweet girl. And you can see the color is very sweet. Everything matches. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to place the adhesive on the ear. So here we have medical grade adhesive, hypoallergenic, and it comes out of the bottle white. The entire edge of the prosthesis is covered in adhesive along with inside. So we have a nice, a nice retentive area. Make sure the inside is getting dry and apply the adhesive so you have a nice white layer. I'm going to show mom what I'm doing. Do you see the area that I'm doing? I'm yeah. not doing here because that's the outside of the ear. That's the part that shows. Only the part that's going to touch skin. Okay. 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 Now zoom in so you can see that this is white. When the adhesive is white, it's not sticky. So you can take a hair dryer on cool and air dry it until it goes clear. Or what I suggest for patients is you put the layer of adhesive on the ear the night before, before the, your baby goes to bed. Let it air dry on its own. In the morning when you get up, you put another layer on, a second layer, and let it air dry while she's taking a bath or having breakfast, whatever. And when she's ready to go out the door, if it's a little white, you just pick up the hair dryer and dry that area, or it should be ready to go. You don't want any white on the undersurface of the ear because that part is not sticky. It will not stick to the ear. And more does not mean better. A thin layer of adhesive is what we want. And as you can see, it's all gone clear. So now I place the second layer. Second layer of adhesive goes on, and again, you'll see it's white. And you don't want to put any adhesive on the outside of the ear that shows because, you know, it, uh, it just makes it tacky. Now this ear is stained inside, so even though the adhesive is on there and in order to take it off, you roll it with your fingers, like when you would remove a piece of rubber cement or a sticker from a glass, um, the color is layered throughout the ear, so it's intrinsically stained. The color will not come off. It will never change color. Now, over a period of time, a couple of years, the color may change because the platinum within the silicone of the ear changes. And in a couple of years, we'll need to make a new ear. But right now, this is S's ear, and I can't wait to see how beautiful and how amazing she is going to be. She's a gorgeous child to begin with, but she is just going to be the toast of the town. <laughs> Okay, it's gone clear, and we'll be ready for part three in just a minute.